Hey, how's it going, New York Yankees fans? It is Felix yet again for NYYNews.com on this rainy, foggy day in New York City. Hey, Yankees fans, if you've been paying attention to uh, the Sambonetti source, NYY News, you have heard us talk about Patrick Corbin numerous times. We even threw out trade proposals that obviously didn't go through. But if you ask me, that Brandon Jury trade was bigger than it originally was. Obviously, we just got Brandon Drury. So, it has come out that Patrick Corbin wants to be a Yankee. He threw out signs pointing in that direction. Like I said, we all know that the Yankees want Patrick Corbin. In my opinion, they will swap Sonny Gray for him, a package including Sonny Gray. I had that sort of trade this offseason. I was called crazy. People kept telling me Sonny Gray is an ace. I kept telling them, no, he's not. He is a National League pitcher at this point. He will be better suited for the NL with that number eight and number nine hitter. So if you trade Sonny Gray to the Diamondbacks, he is under their control for, let's say, half a year or half a season or a couple of months and a full year. So this is why a trade for Sonny Gray will be logical for the Diamondbacks. For the simple fact that we all know that they are a small market team, not that they are, they do fill up their stadium, they do have legit revenue, but they are considered a small market team. So considering the fact that they are small market, obtaining a Sonny Gray and having him for a full season will help them, let's say, re-sign other players that are going to become free agents as well, or other potential free agent targets. So. This trade doesn't sound so far-fetched when you think about it because the Diamondbacks will get other players from the New York Yankees, and they are going to be in playoff contention. People are saying, why would they trade Patrick Corbin to the Yankees if the Diamondbacks are going to be contenders come playoff time? It's simple. You swap them for Sonny Gray. I know Sonny Gray is not having a great year, but he will be a better pitcher in the National League. Just look at the way he pitches. He pitches low, off-speed stuff. He'll just get a lot of batters out in the National League. In my opinion, Sonny Gray is feeling the pressure of playing for the Yankees. Sonny Gray is going up there in age. I think he already reached his peak, and his peak is just going to stay where it's at now or he'll have a few flashes of his old self, I think the Yankees should put him out of his misery and trade him to a National League team. I, for one, would think Sonny Gray would be a number two and number three starter in the NL, and he'll do pretty well. So as of now, my prediction is the Yankees trade for Patrick Corbin come trade deadline. Who knows, Patrick Corbin might fall off a little bit come trade deadline, and it might be even easier to obtain him. But, like I said, if he does fall off a little bit, he's a, that much of a great pitcher that if traded to the Yankees, he will make you a certified contender. Not that the Yankees aren't already the way they're playing now. I'm just saying, you subtract Sonny Gray and put a Patrick Corbin in his spot, I mean, sky's the limit. So, Yankees fans, let me know what you think in the comment section below. Who would you trade for Patrick Corbin, obviously? If you are reading the headlines, Patrick Corbin likes the Yankees. The Yankees like Patrick Corbin. Tell me, who would you trade for him? Would you swap him for Sonny Gray? Does swapping him for Sonny Gray seem impossible? In my opinion, it doesn't. It makes perfect logical sense. So let me know what you think in the comment section below. Follow us on Instagram. It's at NYY Insider. Like always, this has been Felix for NYYNews.com. Hit that share button. Hit that subscribe button. If you're not subscribed yet, hit that like button, and I will check you out next time.